I'm disappointed for sure, but I mean, it is what it is. There's, I can't like change what happened, so I just have to like look forward to working hard in the coming weeks to hopefully get back running as soon as possible. Natalie Shudrowitz was in the middle of a fantastic cross-country season, taking first or second place in big races and setting new personal records. That came to a halt last weekend when Natalie fractured her collarbone in a bike accident. I was carrying something, so I was only riding it with one hand, and I just kind of lost my balance, and I went down on my shoulder. Natalie is far and away Tosa East's fastest runner, so the injury was a big blow to the team. The coach would be like, come on, girls, like, let's go run, and Natalie's already like a mile ahead of us, like already finished. It was you know, definitely unfortunate that you know, it happened to someone that has really kind of put her heart and soul into the sport that she's only been around for a couple years. It's just deja vu from two years ago. Shudrowitz was playing club soccer two years ago when she fractured the same collarbone. After that, she decided to try distance running. Like her sister Emily was a few years back at Tosa East, Natalie has been highly successful in track and cross country. We always relied on her. We always knew that she'd be there in front of us no matter what. So. I don't know, it's going to be weird. We're going to have to step it up a lot. While she recovers, Natalie says she'll spend as much time as possible with her team. She and Coach Glenn Gardner would not rule out the possibility of Natalie racing again this fall. Whether Natalie can return in time for sectionals and the state meet remains to be seen. Her coach, of course, would love to see it happen, but he doesn't want her to push it. Of course, with Natalie's ability to motivate herself, you can't count her out about a week or two weeks rest and then we'll start thinking about possibly um, doing some cross training and hopefully keeping some of the fitness that I've developed over the summer. Coach Gardner is also Natalie's teacher in AP Chemistry where he and some of the kids were dressed up for homecoming this week. Gardner sees the traits that have Shudrowitz in line to be one of her class valedictorians. Self-motivated, just doing all the things a good student should do and you know definitely the sky's the limit in terms of where she's going to go academically. Um, and she's got all her priorities in the right place. I have to really focus on what I'm doing and um, I have to prioritize my time really well because I'm in a lot of different activities, but I mean, I enjoy it. It's not like a chore really for me. Natalie is the president of the Key Club and Amnesty International at Tosa East. Now in a bitter twist of irony, Natalie broke her collarbone while riding her bike home from the Ronald McDonald House where she volunteers. Luckily, she's got people looking after her in the same way she looks after others. I just want her to be healthy and, and get to where she needs to be. And hopefully that includes, you know, being able to run the last meet or two of the year. We wish Natalie all the best in her recovery, and we wish good luck to the Red Raiders, whether they're running with their leader or not. Now here's Colleen Heider presenting the Boston Store Featured Student Athlete Award to Natalie. Natalie, for all you do in school and for your sport, Boston Store is proud to present you with the Preps Plus Student Athlete of the Week Award. Congratulations. Yeah!